Hi Cancer, welcome to your timeless reading for the week ahead. Please remember these readings are general and for the collective. So take what resonates for your situation and leave the rest. If this message doesn't resonate with you, however, check out your other placements, sun, moon and rising signs. A spirit may have a message for you in there. Okay, so we'll be taking a look at your recent past, your current energy and the likely outcome for you this week, Cancer. So in your recent past, you have Hermit, Justice and the Page of Wands. Okay, so you could be dealing with a, a Virgo or a Libra. In your current energy, you have the Two of Swords, the Three of Cups, and the Magician. And in your immediate future, you have the King of Wands, Three of Swords, and the Queen of Swords. And at the base of the deck, you have the King of Swords. Okay, so what I'm feeling here for you is you're definitely dealing with an air sign here. Libra is coming through really strong for you, especially with that King of Swords energy there and the Queen of Swords as well. I feel that there's been something or a situation that's very out of balance and you've really had to rethink your, your future and your next moves in, in whatever the situation is for you. The Two of Swords is very stuck energy here. It's a state of impasse. It's a very difficult decision that you feel that you need to make to be able to move on from this, this state of imbalance. Something's unfair here. That's what I'm getting is unfair. And it's, it's time to focus now and think forward about what your next move is, what you want from the situation. Because I feel like there's possibly been a third party situation here with the person that you're thinking about. Because that three of cups there makes me feel like there's a third party interference for sure. And I feel like by knowing the truth is going to set you free. And that two of swords will move to that magician card where you're definitely going to move on from not knowing the truth to the truth being revealed to you and you being able to move on for sure. King of Wands is very much about taking back your power, being in control and someone's going to get hurt here for sure because that Three of Swords here is a heavy energy. It's heartache, it's loss, it's grief and I'm feeling if you look here there's a lot of tears. Um, so I feel like Spirit's urging you here to face the truth in this situation. Remove yourself emotionally from this situation as well because I feel that there's been something out of balance here. And I feel like you know in your gut, Cancer, what you need to do here. I feel like you have the answer. You know the answer already. And, and that's the toughest part here. So let's clarify for you. Let's get, explore this a little deeper for you. Four of Wands. King of Pentacles. Seven of Swords and the sun okay so as i said the the truth is going to set you free here for sure because someone has been sneaking around someone hasn't been honest with you i feel like this is going to be really shocking to you as well because this person you you trusted you know you put your whole trust in you had a lot of faith in this person and they've broken that trust but i feel that this situation um, will reveal itself and, and change the dynamics in this situation for sure it will cause you some grief it will cause you some heartache for sure but it's something that needed to happen the truth needed to come out because I feel like you've been questioning the person or the situation and doubting yourself and feeling a little bit like am I going crazy here is this situation really happening but the truth coming out will set you free for sure I'm feeling as well that you need to take some time out here. The Four of Swords is uh, removing yourself emotionally from this situation because I feel like emotions are running on high here because of this, this deceit, this betrayal, this potential third party interference here. So let's explore this a little more. Ace of Wands. Good to see here. A nice new energy. I feel like after this low energy of the Three of Swords here, this heartache, this grief, this loss, you're taking back your power here as well. 
with the the king of of wands and the queen of swords really strong energy of being able to especially with that king of swords there remove yourself emotionally from the situation to be able to think rationally and to be very pragmatic about your next approach because i feel ultimately cancer you're someone who's very balanced very much in control and this situation has shocked you to the core so let's explore this a little bit more nine of wands look at that emotions running on high you see all of the tumultuous water hitting the rocks there so i feel like this has caused a lot of emotional upheaval for you ten of cups and again i feel like this situation had to happen because it's bringing in this new beginning for you the king of pentacles is the ultimate commitment long-term stability ten of cups is the ultimate emotional fulfillment happiness success and happiness and joy there with that sun energy so whatever the situation has been for you, it's been um, a really heavy energy for you, for sure. Seven of Pentacles, time of reflection as well for you to really think long and hard about what you want to do in this situation because you have more control in this situation than you realise. And you need to really start to set the boundaries Start thinking about your future here and start thinking about what you really want from, from this situation or this person for sure. Okay, so I'm just going to pull some oracle cards and see what additional messages we have from spirit for you. So I feel like there's a big decision, a big choice here, a big shift and a big change that's going to really test you and test your strength and resilience here but you really do need to remove yourself emotionally from this person or this situation because the four of wands is also good news around a relationship ace of wands is a new and exciting beginning the sun is a yes card the ten of cups is soulmate energy so i feel like someone that you thought would be someone that you would be with is is not the right person for you and it's time to let go of that someone's not being honest here someone's not being truthful so let's see what additional messages we have from spirit for you you're very close to achieving your goal a time to give rather than take and you, uh, your commitment is being tested like i said i feel like you're being tested here so hold your vision so there's something that you've been thinking about something you're reflecting on something that you want to happen Look at that. The energy is gaining momentum. And by letting go of something here in the past, allowing yourself to move on is going to be quite a painful transformation for you. But it's one that you absolutely need to make for you to be able to move towards, you know, your, your goal. Because you're very close to achieving your goal. So whatever the energy has been, there is a little bit more work to come. But you are ultimately taking back your power, taking back your control. And, you know, you are achieving success here. When I see a time to give rather than take, I feel that perhaps you've been expecting too much from this situation. Perhaps you've been expecting more from this situation or this person than they are prepared to give to you look at this surrender letting go at times we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives so let go and all will work out so you definitely like i said going through this transformation letting go and surrendering that freedom there is nothing stopping you the path is clear if you want it to be okay so if you want to free yourself from this past energy then you have to let it go because I feel ultimately by you being more in control and letting it go, that is when you're going to bring the sense of emotional fulfillment, happiness, joy and success. At the base here you have acceptance is key to inner peace. At times we must accept things as they are. There is no point in trying to change that which is beyond our control. So wow, I'm really feeling a strong energy here if you can say that it is time to let go of a situation that's been out of balance for a long time, but you've been scared to walk away from it. But whatever the situation is and has been, there is a period of time where you will go through this transition, this transformation, but ultimately it's moving towards you, this freedom, this ultimate happiness, contentment, joy, success. And just putting you back in control of your life, of your, of the situation. And it's taking you towards a much better 
outcome much better future and I just feel like there's a much more um, happier energy around what's coming for you once you've let go so it may hurt it may be difficult you may find it challenging but spirit's advice is coming through really strong here is to surrender the old so that you can let this new and happy beginning come into your life so I really hope this helps you cancer hope it resonates if it does let me know in the comments don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel as it really does help to support me so yeah good luck with this transformation cancer you are moving towards the ultimate happiness joy and success